Do you remember butchering Mary? I wish I was lonely I'd buy all my company And sell them then instantly Would you do that for me Just to be happy at all Happy at all I wish I was someone else Free from the guilt I felt Backwards fell darkly into my shell When it all ends, will there be anything for me? And I want to know what's died in my soul Keeps plugging up holes, keeps Do you remember butchering Mary? <sighs> Do you remember butchering Mary? Tell me about it. from the beginning. Don't speak to me like I'm a child. I'm only speaking to you how would a patient. Don't speak to me like a psychiatrist either. Well you're the expert, how would you recommend I speak to you? Like a friend. <laughs> I'm not your friend. You were like a friend once. Tell me about that. Why? I want closure. <laughs> You'll have your closure soon. Are you afraid to die? I'm more afraid to live. That I fear. No death. This is where we, where I, why have you come here? I wish to give you this. Now, do you see? Take this away from me. I'm here to help you. I can't face this. I can't face you. 
Well, I want closure. You owe me that much. <laughs> what have you to hold over me? What can you offer a man who's about to die? Release. From my pain? From the abyss. The, the abyss? I've, I've never spoken of it. Oh, well, please try. If not for me, then, well, yourself. She called herself my angel. That's what she said after the first time we made love. She guessed God thought I needed an angel. So he sent me one. Mary saved me. I never told her that enough. But she saved my life. I should have told her every moment of every day. We planned our future together. It's amazing we do that, isn't it? In this crazy fucking world, we actually kid ourselves. We have some control. It provides us comfort. It sedates the mind from the terror of our mortality. Then comes the day when we realise that our dreams are only dreams. The day we can't shape this future of infinite possibilities. One day, our string of hope just snaps. I'm alone. Alone again. Mm. So, before the incident, You can call it murder. Yes, murder. You were working on one of the most anticipated theses ever presented. Many, including myself, waited in eager anticipation. And now, as with all the greatest treasures of humanity, it lays lost. Where is it, William? Here. Yeah. No, it will never be published. Why? If you truly have answered the final question, if you've discovered an explanation for consciousness, why let that fester now? Is that why you're here? You wish me for, to destroy humanity as I once destroyed my wife? <laughs> no one is talking of the destruction of humanity. You fail to realise the power of the truth. With vast canvases woven by memories. Phrase the edges. All tied by the sedation of our comfort. Humanity needs its faith. I won't be the one to destroy that with the truth. You say I cut her wrists. Nearly cut her hands clean off. You say I cut the boy out of her before she died. I love to be on reason, beyond all the treasures the world has to offer. And you say I cut her wrists and I squall my madness on the bed. Hacked my son out of her like a beast. Like a wolf will tear into the womb of a deer and eat the fetus. You're a psychiatrist. You tell me what that means. If you don't know, then I don't know. Do you believe she had developed schizophrenia? Yes. Without doubt. You see, though, there are no ghosts or goblins. There are no hauntings, there are no poltergeists. The thought of possession is 
as archaic as driving to work on a horse-drawn cart. All the madness in the world is in our mind. But belief is a power beyond science. And she believed thoroughly. Tell me of her. She was religious, indoctrinated from birth. Seems strange how much we differed, yet aren't we always attracted to our opposites? I went to see Father Cole again this morning. And what did he suggest? That I take comfort in the Lord and believe in a greater good. A greater good? I've been counting your pills, you have to stick to the prescription. I can still hear him. Please. Come back to me, to me, to me, to me, to me. Don't worry. I'll save you. Mummy will save you. I promise. That baby was my ray of hope. My little shard of sunshine, soon to brighten my life. When I started to lose her, I fell apart. But memories fade quickly. Faint breezes in the tornado of reality. And when the memories are blown away, I wonder how long I can face this world. Should I sit and slowly fall apart? Or should I not? Had she wanted this child, would your actions have been different? That we never know. If you believe in fate, then no. If you believe in fate, I was always destined to hack into her ligaments and stay in the bed with her blood. If you believe in reason, then yes. Take me to a time shortly before the murder. I'm growing tired. I believe it will help. Have you read the work of Dante? You know I have. She was obsessed. She lost herself. She believed our son <laughs> being conceived out of wedlock was being called by the devil that she would go with him through the gates of hell. When she mentioned the abyss, my temper really frayed. Oscura, Oscura. Tanto che, tanto che per piccolo, solo il fondo, e non vi disegnavo con la cosa. He's there, William. I can hear him. How many times you're taking too much medication? He's in the abyss. You are in the abyss. Let us descend now into the blind world. I will not let you stop me from helping him. He is there and he's all alone. He's... he's burning. Please, Mary. Don't leave me here alone. We needn't be alone. We can be together, the three of us. Please. Come back to me. William. Tell me your theories on the mind. Why? It's too dangerous. Ignorance is bliss. Well, you're about to die. And I am the last person you'll ever see. So tell me, William, why are humans aware? 
when other animals are not. It is a gift from God. Strange words from a scientist. No, not God, not that God. Electrons work on probability. Mathematically, they don't exist. That is, until we look at them. We create matter. We have the power over life and death. Consciousness is omnipotent and omnipresent. Alfred, consciousness is God. Through me the way is to the city dolent. Through me the way is to the eternal dole. Through me the way among the people lost. Justice incited my sublime creator, created in me divine omnipotence, the highest wisdom and the primal love. Before me there were no created things, only eterne, and I eternal last. Abandon all hope, ye who enter here. He sits there in the little hole in our brain. He sits in the abyss. The heavens expelled them, not to be less fair, nor them the nevermore abyss receives, for glory none the damned would have from them. But what would humanity do without its faith? What little good in the world would be lost? These have no longer any hope of death, and this blind life of theirs is so debased. They envious are, or every other fate. Humanity would cease to exist because hope makes humanity. For such defects, and not for other guilt, lost are we and are only so far punished that without hope we live on in desire. I'm still human. I'm still human. Despite my crimes. Do you remember butchering Mary? I knew my wife and she seemed possessed. But possession doesn't exist. It's a fairy tale created by religious nuts who scorn psychology and the continual disapproval of parapsychology. Do you remember butchering Mary? That voice was not hers, but it was not of another worldly being. It was created by a mind for defence, and the language summoned from the vast chambers of her dormant memories, from the tapestry of her mind. Ghosts don't exist. <laughs> Heaven doesn't exist. All can be explained. William, do you remember butchering Mary. No, I do not. As well you know. You can have this knife. I have no need for it. Leave me now. Leave me here in peace. I won't leave until I have the answers. Take me there. Take me where you cannot remember. Take me to your abyss. I'll take you from the abyss. I wonder what that means. I wonder if I killed her as I couldn't face or losing her mind. Those words were sewn in some forbidden place in the fabric of my unconscious. I guess you've loosened the threads. But it was you who killed her, wasn't it? If you won't answer me that, then answer me this. Why? You tire me. All of you. William, 
when Pandora gave in to her curiosity and opened the box. All evil escaped and spread over the world. When she snapped it closed, there was one thing that lay at the bottom, and that thing was the spirit of hope, of consciousness, of humanity, of God. William, I want your hope. What are you? Are you a part of me? Do you know what would have happened had a Christian soul opened that box of Zeus? Nothing. That is the power of belief. I am what you see me as. What you're Consciousness allows me to be. To you, I am a part of your personality, a fragment of your failing mind, a cancer, and I am feasting to Mary. I was her son, burning at the gates of hell, to Pandora, a box of all evil, to Jesus, a merciless father. Eli, Eli Lemma. Sabakthani. <laughs> Why have you forsaken me? 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 Abandon all hope, ye who enter here. The sun burns a hole in the sky when you left. As I arrived, how did it come to this We turned ourselves away From bliss, my eyes On your portraits of pain Help fuel the voices 
that are making me insane Why did I throw you away? Cause these voices will haunt me And they'd hurt you if you'd stay